Hola, por favor, and welcome to your daily dose of Fortnite. Today we're going to be going through the new Spyglass Sniper that just came out in the event store. Uh, but first, I just wanted to say a thank you to everyone who has been watching my videos and has subscribed to my channel. I'm going to be doing a giveaway, um, so if you want to know how to enter that, go ahead and check the description of this video. I will link uh, a video describing how to enter and what's going to be given away in that video. But with that out of the way, let's go ahead and check out the Spyglass. Um, as you can see it's 1680 gold, pretty standard for the event weapons, so we're going to go ahead and purchase it. And we will go ahead and take a look at it. So you can read the description here, sniper rifle bolt action flintlock. Accurate high powered rifle with a single round per magazine that kicks like a mule. Her excellent damage and impact make her a prime choice for those who can handle her temper scoped for additional down sights accuracy. So a lot of people were saying they thought this may be pretty much the same weapon as old Betsy. So we are going to take a look and compare real quick to see if that is true. It looked like on Storm Shield 1 the stats were very similar. As you can see the range is pretty much maximum across the entire map because it has the scope on it. But you do see the damage, critical hit chance and damage, fire rate, magazine size, all of this other stuff is exactly the same. Um, let's go ahead and check out if we can change the perks any differently. So this is the same as Old Betsy. These four choices are the same. Obviously you can get any element you want on it. Headshot damage and headshot damage. Yep, so it's got the same five perk choices. Um, as old Betsy as well so it looks like the only difference is going to be the range and it has a scope obviously so we're going to go ahead and level this up and give it a try all right so we've got it leveled up to level 80 or power level 82 i'm going to go ahead and favorite it so i can find it when i need to craft it and let's go ahead and craft one there it is and then once this done, is done, we will hop into a mission and try it out. Just make sure I'm on private here. And for our heroes, we're going to use Tedshot Jess, who is the outlander that specializes in snipers. And we will use her in support as well because we get plus 70% critical damage to sniper rifles. So let's go ahead, hop in a Twine Peaks mission. Um, the weapon is level 82, these heroes that I have are level 82, I am power level 92, but I'm going to hop in a level 82 mission to test it out against some husks. Alright, so we're in the mission now, we're going to go ahead and equip it, and let's find some husks. Let's see, there's a water one over there, this is fire you can see, so we'll see how much damage we do against a water husk. Let's see if we can go for a headshot. Oh, and I didn't even see that. But you can hear that is awesome sounding sniper, um, and you can see the scope really helps out with the range there. Was that 5,500? I couldn't even tell. 55,000 maybe? Nope, must have been 5,500 because that was 10,000. <laughs> Boom! And they are dead. Let's go ahead and put the teddy down. We're getting too close. But yeah, so it looks like this is pretty much the same as um, the old Betsy. It's just got the scope for easier long range uh, shooting. Let's see if we can find a mist monster to kill. There's not going to be any over there. And let's check it out. Sorry survivors, I'm not going to save you right now. But yeah, I would definitely recommend this, especially if you like the old Betsy sniper. Um, because it's essentially, like I said, the same weapon, but it has the scope on it, so you can just see farther and it has a longer effective range. Um, it'll just do damage. Uh, it'll do the same damage you know, farther away than Old Betsy would. So I don't see any mist monsters, but we will go ahead and try on these nature husks that I saw, since it is a fire weapon. See what kind of weapon damage we can do with it. So they're all the way over here. And I couldn't see the number. Oh, gotta reload. 
<laughs> that is great sounding weapon. Survivor in danger. And I can't see those numbers. Let's see, shoot something a little bit closer. Just a normal husk. Boom, 40,000 right there. That is awesome. All right, so there you go. That is some gameplay with the new Spyglass Sniper. Um, like I said, I'd probably recommend picking it up if you got the gold for it. So as always, guys, if you enjoy my videos, feel free to subscribe and hit the notification button so you'll be notified whenever I release a new one. And don't forget to check out the description of the video for a link to my giveaway video. And other than that, thanks for watching and have a great day.